We accept everything that's in the report. Um, since January last year, we drew a line under some of the practices that are referred to within the report. And we've set about changing this business. And for the last 15 months, that's what we've been doing. Uh, and if you read the report, the report actually does pull out that they've seen, and our suppliers have seen, a very significant change in the way that Tesco has operated since that uh, period of time. So uh, I accept what's in the report, but we've drawn a line under the past and we've set about changing the business completely. And I see an awful lot of feedback that actually those changes are appreciated by our suppliers and indeed also recognised by our customers. Have you sought to make redress to any of the suppliers? Obviously, names are not mentioned in the Judicator's report, but have you reached out to suppliers and offered to compensate them for past malpractice? Well, as you know, I've personally visited and spoken to a large number of both our large and our small suppliers since I started in the business. As we've set about re-energising that relationship, we've apologised both privately and publicly uh, for the behaviour that was happening inside our business at that time. And we've set out a completely different way of wanting uh, to work together. And I'm delighted with the way that our suppliers have engaged with that. And the results that we've had as a business have come in no small part by re-energising the relationship we have with our supplier base.